We got breakfast included apparently, so I've got vegetable and pesto sandwich with some fruit. And look at Amelia's, it looks amazing. I'm quite jealous. Our hostel is really nice. Why is it all blurry? Hi guys, sorry for this short break in my vlog. My dogs are barking outside, I'm sorry about that. Ellie, stop it! But this part of the video is in collaboration with Junkyard.com, so thank you to Junkyard for working with me again. I love Junkyard so much and I have worked with them many times as you guys know and I'm never disappointed with what they send me. Of course I have a coupon code for you guys that you can use um, which will give you 12% off everything if you buy for more than 500 kroner which is like 48 euro I think and it's valid in the whole of Europe but the code won't work for things that are already on sale. I don't think it will anyway. And my coupon code is valid until the 21st of July. So let's get cracking I guess. The first thing I got here is this t-shirt which is really cool. It's like I think it's a famous skater on it it's from the brand sweet skbt sweet skirt. i don't know how to pronounce it i love these plain tops with just like a picture in the middle i think they look really cool i got this in an extra small and i mean it's not too tight it's a little bit baggy like i like it and if i undo it it's just like just like this a normal t-shirt and these jeans i also got from junkyard i really really love them they're so cool these are just from Junkyard's own brand. I, I got them in the size 25 and they fit perfectly. They're just a little bit long in the legs, but I am five foot two, so I'm quite short. But it's also like kind of a cool look with long trousers. I think it's like becoming trendy. Um, so yeah, it's a look. They're really wide in the bottom, which I really love. And they're light wash, so that's them. So next up I got this feeler top in the size large because they didn't have any other sizes but I thought it would be cool to have like as a dress kind of or like an oversized hoodie just. It is so comfy. As you can see it's really long in the arms and it's from feeler. It's got this thing there and then it's got feeler on the arm and yeah. And this is how long it is if I just stand up. So I could wear it as like a dress with like some cycle shorts underneath or something. And the material is really nice as always with Fila. It's super, super soft inside and it's just white and I think everyone needs a white hoodie. So comfy. This thing is also from Junkyard's own brand and I have this in purple as well. It's hanging over there and I've used it so, so many times. So, and this was just really intriguing to me. <laughs> I really think this pattern is so cool it's like mint green with zebra stripes i got it in an extra small just because i had the purple one in extra small and i thought it fitted me really well this is going to be so cozy for the autumn and the winter time just like walking around in this it's teddy material as well and on there it says urban tears for forest fears it's a cool top if you feel like you want to be a bit extra, you know. Okay, then I got the long shorts. Um, cycle denim. I have never worn a pair of cycle shorts. I'm kind of scared of them. Also kind of scared of these. Like, I don't know if I like the trend or not yet. But that's what I'm going to find out with these. So these are from Junkyard. They're black, plain, quite stretchy. Got them in small. Let's try them on. Okay, the fit is really nice. Like... They're really stretchy and I feel like I've got a lot of room in them. They are like mid waist as you can see. They don't go all the way up to my belly button. I guess I would have preferred them to be a little bit higher. But I can still work this. I think. I mean they are really comfy so I probably will be wearing these this summer. They're kind of cool. So next thing I got is this Fila hoodie. I got it in an extra small. It's black. Yeah, You can never go wrong with a black hoodie. And it's got like gold text down the down the arms and it just says feeler on it 
it's really soft inside it also has the classic feeler text on the front there and I did get it in an extra small but it's still like the perfect size that I really like you have got loads of room it's not like tight or anything so it does have an oversized sizing naturally so it's got also the junkyard thing here I like it next thing I got was this halter top and I got this one in a black last time I think it's from junkyards own brand I got it in a small and they're just so so handy you can pair them with anything and everyone just needs basic black and white halter or tank tops like this in their life it's got a nice back perfect for the warmer days in the summertime now I got a denim jacket it's in like light wash I got it in an extra small it's a bit tight in the arms maybe I should have got a small but yeah I can still wear it. denim jackets are a staple in everyone's wardrobe aren't they okay and then i put, got a pair of jeans but they sent me them in the wrong size i got an l instead of an extra small but i'm going to show you them anyway and insert a picture um from the website if i'd got these in the right size i think she's going to send me them in the right size so i will be uploading an instagram picture to instagram probably or like a story or something you will see them on my instagram anyway but i got these yeah as i said in an l a junkyard's own brand and these are wide and cropped and they are so nice look at them aren't they absolutely gorgeous last but not least chucker guys you probably don't know this because i haven't talked about this yet but me and my friend louise really want to learn to skate she's already a lot better than me and i only have a penny board so I can't really practice properly so I got this skateboard and I'm really really excited to start learning I think I'm gonna do like a mini series on my channel and if I don't get enough footage I'll just put it all in one video um but I'm really excited because I've always since I was little wanted to be a skater girl and thought skating was really cool like yeah but I'm also really scared so I don't know how it's gonna go I haven't broke a bone in my body probably because I'm too scared to do anything that will put me in a dangerous situation like that but it's really nice it's from sweet skbt and it's just got like a, a woman's silhouette body on the back it's really nice it's got like pink there i think it's 8.25 in length or size really cool i'm so excited to try it out that's it for this part thank you for watching i hope you find something everything will be linked down below so click the links below if you are interested in anything and don't forget to use my coupon code rebecca12 for 12 off until the 21st of july and yeah valid in the whole of europe as i said enjoy the rest of the vlog bye so now we're in where are we now we are in kuta uh yeah the flight and everything went really well we took two flights yesterday it was so good and we didn't realize until last night that we've got free breakfast so we went down and had breakfast oh i need to tell them what i need for breakfast because i'm if you're vegetarian you have to tell them like one day before but the breakfast was really, was really good and then we've just been chilling by the pool but unfortunately it was like cloudy so now we're gonna go to town because we've got a pull and bear we're gonna do some shopping like i've got no room to shop but we're still gonna like go and look we're gonna go eat first and then tonight we're gonna go out this is our little place i don't know if i've showed you we've got bunk beds i just hung this up because it needs to dry uh, it's really small and then we've got this little toilet which is nice and fresh so yeah this is Kara Kara in so shook they've got bath and body works here i thought like they only had bath and body works in america also got victoria sacra so we're at this place called sushi tea and we don't know yet if this is going to be really really cheap or really expensive but i got six of these inaris i've already had one so nice i got two omelettes and i've got six of these avocados and they've got this really nice sauce that I don't know what it is. It tastes like kind of barbecue-ish and it was so good. And now we're at uh, McDonald's. I've got a frappy mocha and a chocolate cake. <laughs> Yum. Breakfast, this is mine. 
so we were out at Sky Garden last night and it was really good even though it was a Monday like there wasn't that many people out but it was still so much fun we were in like the hip-hop and R&B part and they were playing really good music all night so we got back at like half past three and now it's currently what time is it it's Tuesday the 2nd of April, half past 11, and we just had breakfast, and now we're gonna do some washing for the first time. We have done some washing for hand, like in the sink, but now we're gonna do our first load of wash. So we've got, we've sorted it into dark and light wash, so we're gonna go do that. And then we're just gonna chill out by the pool for a bit, we think, so. So we're eating really cheap lunch at our hostel. We got free iced tea with a drink this was like 30,000 rupee and I got fried rice with an egg and these we're at this place called Crum and Coaster which we got recommended and the food looks so good don't know if you can hear me but I got a veggie burger the fries are amazing Amelia got chicken pesto pasta looks so good So we just ate at a place called Crust and something. It was a really, really nice veggie burger uh, with so good french fries. And it was a little bit pricey, but it wasn't like that price at all. And we also did a little bit of shopping. I got the top that I tried from Brandy Melville. And I also got a pair of earrings, which I'm in love with. I've been loving the trend of having like snake earrings. I think that's really cool. I got them in gold because recently I've been loving wearing gold rather than silver. And this is the t-shirt I got. I just love this style of t-shirt and it's cropped. It's currently half past nine. Focus on me. Fuck, fuck. We're getting up early tomorrow for surf camp. We're going to Mojo Surf Camp, which I'm so excited about. We're doing the free day one. I've never in my life been surfing, nor has Amelia. So it's definitely something new for us and I'm really excited to try it out. Like, I don't think I'm gonna be pro at it or even be good at it or anything, but I really want to try it out because I feel like it looks like so much fun so we're getting up at 6 a.m for that or like half past 5 a.m actually mm, so we need to get an early night tonight but yeah they're just our plans good morning everybody today it is what day is it it's wednesday at six o'clock and today's the day we're going to surf camp hola como esta <laughs> so this is my outfit oh i got this yesterday from brandy melville and i these shorts i don't know how i've been able to live without soft shorts but i got these from beshka i think and they're in like olive green i really like them and then i'm wearing my nike bikini underneath this is my more full coverage bikini because i don't know if we're gonna get like wet suits yet i think we're gonna get some kind of suits um but yeah i'm so excited guys becoming a pro sofa in three days we're gonna go down and get breakfast soon and check out Indian burritos with potato masala. Never had it. Only no millions have. So we're currently at the loft. We got recommended this place and they are not disappointed. It looks amazing. So we have just been on our first surf lesson and it was actually so much fun. Uh, it was hard, but I mean, it went fine. I thought it was actually gonna go a little bit worse maybe. I could ride a few waves and it was a lot of fun. As you can see, I've catched the sun quite a bit, but hopefully it's not too bad. I'll put some after sun on. And we got upgraded to a better room. We were supposed to stay in a dorm, and now we've got this twin room to ourselves because it was full booked and that is just amazing. I'm so happy about this. This was what I was surfing in and then you got like a blue top to wear. So that was so much fun. Let's do a little room tour. We've got a sink out here for some reason, which is really cool for selfies. This door, really nice and rustic. And then we've got all of our stuff there. And this two beds, perfect. So we've got duvet, then we've got this cool surf thing there. And we've got the view, the front view, which is like, we have a balcony and down there's the pool. 
where everyone hangs out and has breakfast. We've got a little closet thingy. And yeah, it's just amazing, guys. Me and Amelia were like the only girls and and we both had like an instructor that was with us the whole time. I don't think everyone had that, uh, but we were also like not very good. So that could be why they stayed with us. They were so helpful and really good and had a good time. We were out in the water for about two hours, I think, and we're going tomorrow again at seven. So I'm really excited for the morning one and we might go to a place called Old Man's and have some beer pong because they said that that should be good. Uh, we're going down in like half an hour to have a look at the photos so yeah and they were gonna like tell us how to improve our technique and like what we were doing wrong by looking at the pictures and i'm kind of scared of that but uh yeah also i'm full of sand yeah life is chill i love it i like when i was on the waves it was so much fun a little bit scary though because it felt like i was gonna fall over a lot of the time but it was good fun So I've got this avocado toast and she's got scrambled eggs and bacon and then we're waiting for smoothies as well. It looks really Instagram friendly. So now we've got the food in. I got this like mango smoothie which looks with passion fruit looks amazing and like avocado toast. And Amido got like two smoothies and that. And now we're just taking some Instagram pics. Hi guys, so we left Mojo today. It's currently six o'clock. We've been having a lazy day because we checked out of Mojo and it is the 5th of April. And it's a Friday, but we've been partying two nights in a row and now I've got sick. So I've got cold. As you can hear my voice is like so sore and rasp, so sore and my nose is really blocked. And I also feel a little bit fevery. So I've just been like relaxing for about 40 minutes I think so that's been really nice and now I'm feeling a little bit cold I'm actually gonna put the aircon up so now we're in a new place just like three minutes away from Mojo but the wi-fi is really bad in our room like it's a nice big size room but it smells back damp and the wi-fi is not really good in the room as I said but yeah this is how it's looking I think we're going to Shake Shack to have dinner because we've heard it that it's really good there so we've just been chilling at surf camp like by the pool but the weather's been really bad it's been like raining all day but we went with a girl from the Neverlands to a little cute cafe and I had a smoothie and it was we just sat there and talked for like an hour or like an hour and a half and it was just really nice and cozy so that's basically what we've been doing today and now we're just gonna head out for dinner so I thought I'd show that I don't think we're going out tonight because I'm feeling like this we just wanted to chill in our room and watch Paradise Hotel but because the internet's so bad, don't know if we're gonna be able to do that, but we will see. I might bring my laptop so I can download something. <laughs> Thank you. 
We've got veggie nacho plate and Emilia got tacos. Yummy. We're at Bethel Nut Cafe. Is that a puppy? Yeah. Oh, so sweet. How old is he? Uh, What's his name? Uh, Uchu. Oh. Uchu. This like I think it's a French brunch place and I have French breakfast so I got a croissant and then a baguette and then I got this dragon fruit and mango smoothie and it looks amazing and it's currently 11 o'clock Sunday the 7th and we're leaving to Ubud tomorrow